the back. He had to take up with the Malika mystic. Back in 1693, the people of Salem, Massachusetts... Witches! Yes? ...thought they got rid of the Sanderson sisters for good. Uh, we shall be back! <laughs> Hey, Section Monkeys, Hocus Pocus 2 just came out last month, and that brings back all the nostalgia from the very first Hocus Pocus movie, because I ate it up as a kid. I was born in 1990, this came out in 1993. Oh, I watched this so many times as a kid for many reasons. One is definitely that horror, like, scare factor. It's perfect for a kid to watch. It's, like, just enough scary to be like, okay, this is cool. But it's totally a, for kids. But, um, yeah, I love this movie so much. Honestly, for my first crush ever, Danny was definitely my first crush. For any, I was probably like six watching this. I was like, who is this Danny girl, you know? For supper. I'm not hungry. Ooh, but we are. Uh, but I'll never forget um, Allison. I thought the casting was perfect. In fact, it took place in Salem. You know, it makes sense for witches. And they have the three witches, you know, the Sanderson sisters. I thought they hit a home run on that. But really the, just kind of, this was start for horror movie for me. This is what really got me in the love of horror genre. Like this, the Goosebumps, you know, those up there. Uh, Don't Be Afraid of the Dark, That's So Weird. Definitely Hocus Pocus is definitely in there. I absolutely give it a big nod for that. <laughs> She's done for. Not yet. You wake my father. Summon the elders. Go! It's a timeless classic. Seriously, like, the minor scares, the jump scares, you know. Um, the la It makes you laugh a lot. Even watching it, you know, all these years later, I'm still laughing over the same jokes. To the night! They love to fly. And it shows. Good night. Sleep time, no screaming. <laughs> it's just a fun time from start to finish. It really is. And it's a great family vibe. You know, you can definitely sit down with your kids and just enjoy watching it. And then that's why Hocus Pocus 2 really did such a great job. I actually enjoyed it. I can't wait to talk about it in my next review. But that Hocus Pocus 2 really brought back a lot of this nostalgia from this movie. I'm very happy for that. In case Jimi Hendrix shows up tonight... Here's my number. I mean, at the end of the day, this movie is totally rewatchable for many reasons. It just doesn't get boring. It really doesn't. The music is great. The cinematography is awesome, especially like the POV of the witches where they're flying around, you know. Um, but Sarah Jessica Parker, she's also cool to look at. Um... But no, this movie does not get old at all. Tubular. I'm Jay. This is Ernie. How many times I gotta tell you? My name ain't Ernie no more. It's Ice. Ice. This is Ice. Here's a little fun thing. Right after they burn the witches when they're celebrating in the background, you see a water fountain. That is actually from the Friends water fountain. So, I thought that was cool. Uh, Leo DiCaprio actually turned down the role to play Max uh, to end up playing the character in what's in Gilbert Graves. So, you know, with him, it would have been cool to see him in this, but I'm glad he did because I like the guy that played Max. Even though he's kind of like a one-hit wonder for an actor, but I think he played really great in this. At the end of the day, I'm definitely going to give this movie an 8.2 out of 10. Um, man, I just will never get... Oh, this movie would never get old for me. I would absolutely watch Hocus Pocus to the day I die. I hope I have kids. I hope I have grandkids where I can watch this movie with them just to show them, like, this is one of my early loves of horror movies. Um, it's perfectly okay for kids to watch. And, um, God, I love this movie. I really do. I wish I could rank it higher, but it's just still a kid's movie. But I'm always going to be watching it. All right, Section Monkeys, let me know in the comments below. Is this one of your nostalgia movies? Do you guys enjoy watching these movies where it brings back all these good memories? Or is this just a black movie?
All right, Sex Monkeys, well, I hope you all have a good day. And remember, please be kind and rewind that VHS tape when you return. Remember, Winnie, remember, remember. I don't, Is that a line? Go, oh, I love that. I thought I was brilliant in that. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm not supposed to say that. Sorry. What was your next question? Look, another glorious morning. Makes me sick. <laughs>